Got some jazzy music going this morning. So we are uh, at Disney Springs. We're gonna be walking around grabbing the new cookie of the month for Gideon's. It is the uh, a spinoff of their peanut butter coffee that they have, or a Peebs if you wanna be, uh, you know, sound like a local. <laughs> wanna be cool. Yeah. Super excited, gonna grab some cookies, check out some shops, uh, see about some new shops that are coming to Disney Springs soon, and uh, just take a, have, a, have an easy stroll. Okay, folks, so we are headed over to Gideon's. Surprise, surprise. Um, I just had to make it known. This is probably the first time I've ever had my hair down. <laughs> and I said, Weston, I'm making it a point to put my hair in this because it's going up. It is very warm. Um, so Special day. Yes. Don't get too excited. You're probably never going to see it again. <laughs> in honor of celebrating, we're going, to, uh, we're going to kick the day off with some breakfast, cookies for breakfast, uh, peanut butter cookie, and some peanut butter coffee. It's a lot. Um, but yeah, so come along. There's tons of people here. <laughs> yes, much different. It's 9.51, technically it doesn't open till 10, so it's pretty nice. Early bird gets the cookie. Or the dance. That's all I got, not a dancer. <laughs> Alright, first up, I've had this before. This is their peanut butter nitro cold brew. I believe that is uh, some cocoa sprinkled on the top. This thing is absolutely amazing. It's a little on the sweet side, so if you like, you know, just dark coffee, no sweetener, no sugar, this might not be for you. Uh, I drink a lot of sweetened coffee. This is, this is absolutely my favorite. I can just, one gulp and it's gone. It's so good. I think it's good. I just need it to be like ice cold. It's, it's kind of like on the thicker side, if you ask me. So if it gets warm, I don't want it anymore. Um, yeah, you got, it's, it's good. Yeah, you gotta give it a really good shake, get it nice and cold. Here we are. Don't look at me, look at the cookies. So Delicious ah. things always. So it's always like, you know, it's like when you're picking the chocolates out of the box and you have to poke a hole in the bottom to figure out which has got what. I'm gonna smell and see if I can figure out. I don't know. Oh, it's this one. I found it. Snipped it out. Is this the flavor of the month? This is the flavor of the month. Oh, look at that. Looks good. All right, so this cookie is the peanut butter nitro cold brew. Uh, the cookie is also laced with freshly ground decaf espresso, Reese's peanut butter cups. Man, does that look good. And I think Reese's pieces. Reese's pieces? Reese's pieces. I say Reese's pieces, it's not correct. But... Comment down below, is it Reese's pieces or Reese's pieces? Here we go. Is it that good? It's good, but it is a lot of peanut butter. Yeah. So I would definitely recommend a coffee or a milk. Maybe just a normal coffee. Do you think that that would balance it better or do you think that this is too much? Actually, I think they go hand in hand. Mm. Mm. 
your whole calorie intake in two bites. Yep, good to go for the day. All right. I don't really want very much of this, but I'll take a small bite. What kind of bite was that? I'm so hot. It is good. I'll say. The consistency or the texture or whatever of this cookie is nice. I don't know if it's because like it's a million degrees outside, but it's very like smooth and like soft. It's very soft. Very soft. That's good. Man, it is a hot, hot one here today at Disney Springs, but man, this is beautiful. What do you think? Nice Florida weather? It's a hot one. <laughs> so Sarah just made a uh, funny comment that I had to get for you guys. So I said, do you want to go to Lulu and, and uh, is there anything that you want to go see? And she said, I don't usually go to look for anything. I just walk in and see if this store speaks to me. <laughs> like what? <laughs> yeah, it speaks to me with a lot of dollar signs is what it does. But uh, yeah, you never know. Those who know, know. It's like that and Target. You don't know what you're going for. Target knows what you're going for. And it tells you. It spoke. How does a store speak to someone? That's the most random thing. It just places items that you look at and you go, hmm, must have. And that's how it speaks to you. <laughs> um, so now we're gonna go to Pele. Pele Soccer. Uh, those of you that know, I'm a big soccer, what was that? I think it was my hand. Uh, I'm a big soccer guy, uh, played in college, and I'm actually wearing a Leeds jersey right now. Our brother-in-law is actually Leeds. from Leeds, so yeah, go Leeds. We EPL, actually... The EPL's kicking off this weekend, so in honor of that, might get a New Jersey. Yes, see, he's gonna let the store speak to him. still yet to see this movie. I, uh, the day we were going to go, Margo was not feeling great, so we uh, decided to opt out of that. polo for work don't judge me Leeds fans wearing the Leeds and I just got a Chelsea polo so. yeah. come for him in the comments up the blues I mean I do like that that actually doesn't look bad at all yeah that's pretty sweet oh yeah I am ready to walk into this air conditioning So this is where we love to come and get our candles, our um, I don't think it's here anymore. waxes, no, um, and little like oil for your diffusers. You can get the smell from Avatar. Um, it's called oh gosh, what's Clover it called? World. Clover World. Um, it's from Bose candles. That's B O W E apostrophe S. You're welcome, Bose. It smells so good. So usually they have it here in the co-op store, but I know that they're opening. Yeah, Bose is actually opening up their own, I guess maybe pop-up, I'm not sure what you want to call it, but their own store here in Disney Springs, so maybe they're moving all their stuff over there. But I don't believe it's open yet. Um, oh, wait, actually, found it! Lucky us. So good. That is the best yeah. smell. So those of you who have been on Flight of Passage, you know when you're going through um, that forest. one section of the forest and it smells 
amazing. This is actually the smell. I also think it's the same on uh, Soren when you go through Africa, oh, that smell. Yes, yeah. I believe it is in Soren as well. So definitely recommend coming and grabbing that. Express. Uh, it is going to be turned into an Indian restaurant soon. Not sure on the ETA as far as when it will be open, but it's going to be called, I believe it's EAT, E-E-T, and it's going to be uh, Indian cuisine. <laughs>